everyone, Adam with UploadWP.com here, and in this video we're going to continue customizing the Nimble theme by showing you how to set up the featured image slider. Now on the Nimble theme by default, the top section is this image slider here, which since we don't have any content is just a static post. First thing you're going to want to do is create a new category for your posts that will appear in the featured image slider. So we're going to hover over posts and go to categories. Now you can name it whatever you want, but I like to st stick with uh, featured. Just because if you have a lot of categories going, it'll be easier to remember that these are your featured posts. So we're going to add new category. And then we're going to go ahead and create some content to go in the featured slider. So we're going to go to add new post. We'll just call it test and be sure to mark it in the featured category. Now if you upload an image into the post it won't appear in the slider section you have to set it as a featured image which if you scroll down is just right over here. So we're gonna pick an image we'll just have some randomly uploaded images here so we're gonna use that and we'll just put some uh, some filler content in here. Alright we're gonna publish the post Just gonna make a couple more here. So now that we have some content, we have to tell the image slider where to find it. So under appearance, you can go to nimble theme options. And it's nice that it makes a, uh, its own tab for the featured slider so it's real easy to find. And here you can turn the featured slider off and uh, choose whether or not the, the articles are duplicated in other parts of your website. So we're going to go to Featured Posts Category and then select our newly created Features category. Scroll all the way to the bottom and hit Save. We're going to go back to our website, use Control R or Command R if you're on a Mac to refresh it. And now you can see our posts appear in the image slider. Now you're going to want to be sure the images are the right size. You can see these are probably a little too big they uh, overlap here and they kind of peek out so you're gonna want the content to be whatever this display size is. A few other things you can customize on this here's where you can change the amount of posts to show um, you can switch this on and pull from pages if you like rather than posts uh, down here you can disable or turn on automatic slider animations and set the amount of time you would like for each slide to display. And of course, if you ever want to revert to the originals, you can hit uh, defaults right here to return everything to normal. That's pretty much it for the image slider. Thanks for watching.